hope you all are doing great and having a great day so far. I am back with a very exciting video which I have never done on my channel so far. So today I am going to review a new concealer. This new concealer is being compared to one of very, uh, I would say, widely used concealer and that is this concealer by Makeup Revolution and this is being compared to Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Tarte Shape Tape Concealer is not that easily available here in Sweden. So I think if this is a dupe for Tarte Shape Concealer, then I think this is a big deal because this is very cheap as well as this is very easily available. So I'm gonna try both today on my eyes and see if they are similar or is it just a, you know, a marketing thing that this is similar to Shape Tip Concealer because this is quite popular and it is actually really good. So I'm gonna test out this one on my right side and this one on my left side. So let's get started. So on my right side, I'm gonna use Tarte Shape Tip Concealer and the shade that I am in is C10 and if you see the applicator of both are pretty similar it's just that this is a bit smaller when compared to Tarte Shape Tip Concealer so yeah this is one similarity that both the concealers have kind of similar uh, I would say almost similar applicators this is actually quite a thick concealer and I do see that it is quite thick, so this is going to be probably very full coverage. I'm going to take a beauty blender to blend this out. Actually blends really good. Now I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape on my left side of the face. I feel that the color, this one is more yellow and the Makeup Revolution is a bit lighter. So I'm using a different beauty blender to blend out the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. So on the left side of my face, I've used the Tarte Shape, Conceal Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and on the right side, I've used the Real Technique. And to be honest, I feel that Tarte Shape Tape Concealer is a tad bit more covering because I see it has more coverage than the Makeup Revolution, but the difference is not that major. Now I'm going to set it up with the powder quickly before it starts creasing. So if you see both the sides look similar after setting it with the powder, I don't see a very major difference. It's just that before setting it with the powder, I could see that Shape Tape Concealer was a tad bit more covering than the Makeup Revolution and I do see that none of these settle in the fine lines as of now. So, so far I like the Makeup Revolution concealer. Now I would be using this darker shade to contour my face and the shade that I'm using is C14. a brush to blend the the contour the shape is not that bad actually I quite like the shape it's that perfect 
warm as well as cool tone mixture of both it's not that warm that it's gonna look orange on your face or it's not that cool tone that's gonna look gray on your face so if you're of my complexion i would say this is a really really good and affordable liquid contouring concealer and it did blend really well i don't see that it had i had to you know really go there several times to blend it it did blend really well so i've used both the products that i bought from the makeup revolution line that was the lighter concealer to highlight my under eyes and highlighting the normal areas that i usually do and a darker shade to actually contour my face so both the products are now on my face and i must say that i like them i'm not that disappointed with them so i would be giving you guys the review in depth and and would be telling you more of my thoughts on this product but before that i will go ahead and complete the rest of my face and then i'll get back to you guys with my final thoughts so hi guys so I'm done with my complete face and I just wanted to quickly give you guys my thoughts on this product and as I did not mention that this was the first time I've used this product on my face and I must say that I'm quite happy. I would say that it is pretty close to of Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Yes, so I just wanted to talk about the shades and the shade range as well as the price. So this so this product comes in 18 shades which is an amazing thing for a drugstore brand drugstore brands don't really come out with a lot of uh, you know um, shade range but this has 18 shades which is quite a big deal for me because being a warmer tone it's really hard sometimes to get your shade and yeah so sometimes you have to go in with drugstore lighter shades and then you know fix it up with your setting powder and then face setting powder and and you work with it but this has 18 shades so there's something for everybody and as i mentioned before i've used c10 to conceal my face or highlight my face and c14 to define or to contour my face i quickly wanted to say that this retails for seven dollars each which is around 56 kroner swedish kroners and i would say that it's quite a good deal so i must say that this is quite an impressive product that makeup revolution has come out with i will say that the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, it's not that easily available here in Sweden. I had to order it from QVC uh, from a UK website and I had to pay shipping. These are at the moment not available in Sweden, but I'm pretty sure that they will be available uh, maybe in a month or two's time. I ordered this from Super Drug, a UK based retailer, and these are already available in India. So, you know, you actually can buy these in india and you do get your shades in this 18 so i'm really happy that a drugstore brand has actually thought about you know getting into something or starting a revolution wherein you make something for every kind of skin tone which i'm really really happy about because i usually don't get my shade here in sweden so i end up buying nars or tart so these are a savior for me because these are so good in quality as well as they save a lot of money so now i will be showing you guys the swatches of tart shift tape concealer and as well as the makeup revolution define and conceal so first I would be swatching the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and the shade that I use is medium. So this is Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and now I would be swatching the Makeup Revolution just under it. I don't know if the camera can actually capture this but there is a very very minor difference in the color the top one is star shape tape and this one is makeup revolution and the color is 
almost almost same yes so I would say that makeup revolution is actually a dupe for Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I would say that Tarte Shape Tape Concealer it's a bit expensive it is almost around 251 Swedish crowns when I buy it from QVC and paying just 56 Swedish crowns for makeup revolution is is obviously a win-win for me because I do not use Tarte Shape Tape Concealer that often because it's not that easily available here for me. So getting a dupe, I'm so so happy and I must say that it did not actually sink in any of my fine lines or any of these lines under my eyes. It's actually quite flawless just like Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. I don't know if camera can capture that but it is actually really really beautiful. Yeah, so my final thoughts about this product is that this product is actually quite dope and if you are looking for a drugstore or I would say if you're looking for even a concealer uh, irrespective of drugstore or high-end, I would highly recommend checking out Makeup Revolution concealers. Yeah, so that was it guys. So I hope you enjoyed this first impression and review of this conceal and define concealer and yeah. So thank you for watching and if you did enjoy this video, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!